Oh man, oh man. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Damn. <coughs> oh! Damn. I never burped that much times before. Three times, who beating that? But anyways, here we go again, man. Y'all already know. Well, I don't know if y'all know, but if y'all don't know, now y'all go know. I was, I, um, damn, I'm stuttering bad. I was supposed to, um, not supposed to. Um, y'all know how, damn. What I was trying to say is, y'all know how I did a video, me selling my Glock on eBay. Cause I did, basically I did a video on my main channel, selling my guns on eBay to see how much I make in 24 hours, right? But the only reason I, I did that video is cause I gotta get rid of my guns. But now I have to get rid of all of them because y'all already know, man, I'm moving out. And I can't bring all of these with me. Just know wherever I go, we're going to start up a new collection. But I don't think it's going to be BBs. But we ain't going to get into that. But anyways, I have to post literally all of them. So I posted like almost all my guns up on. Did I, even, I don't think I posted my ATC though. I, I ain't ready to let go of that one. I ain't let go of the ATC. That's going to be my only post. Man, until I actually leave. But I posted up everything yesterday. And today, I made two sales. Well, yesterday I made one. Today I made one. But bro, now I'm low-key sad. Because... Let me show y'all, bro. Well, the first thing I showed is this one right here. This, I bought this. It came with no battery or nothing. It cost me like $200. Like, this is one of my most expensive guns. But I sold it for like $110 because it has no battery, no box. But look, I got the post for the low. You feel me? Hey, $100. This is brand. I didn't even shoot it. I didn't even shoot it straight out the box. It just doesn't have the box and no battery. But it came with no battery. Like, the more expensive guns come with no battery. So, $110, basically brand new. You feel me? I got the post for the low. Let me show y'all which one, man. This one right here, y'all can see the tag is still on it and everything, man. But y'all see this one sold right there. This thing is long. Ugh, that thing is long, almost like my. Nah, let me stop. But that one sold, and the one that I'm actually sad about, even though I kind of I didn't touch it in like so long. But you know how, like, basically, for example, let's say you have set the sitting in your room, right? You never touched it for like so long, and then someone asks for, it. oh, can I have it? You will be like, nah. You feel me? Even though you don't use it, it's basically like I'm basically in that situation because like. I don't know, bro. This is lit. I think this is actually better than an 18C. Like, boom. Like, come on, bro. That 19... Well, this is a 2011. With a drum mag? That's hard, bro. But this one sold too. I think I sold that one for like 110. I think it was like 110 for this one. So whoever got that one, that was a steal too. Because I think I paid like... For the mag alone, I paid like 90. Now the gun alone was like 100 or something. So, boom. Got that sold too. So now I'm about to go to Staples so I could go get some boxes. So I could put these in a the box. Feel me? I got to go get some more bubble wrap. I got to go get the shipping labels. And then these two got to go. But y'all already know I got so much more. So hopefully I said all of them before I go. Because if not, I don't know what's going to happen. But anyways, y'all stay tuned. Let's go outside. One more thing, you guys let me know if you guys like these series, well, like this little gun packaging and stuff like that series, because this is like the third video I did on this channel about this, but it's because this is something I won't like probably even record. I'll probably just go to Stables, go get the box, ship it off, and that's it. But I'm like, I might as well record it, so y'all let me know if y'all actually like this, man, but we out here. Yeah, this is crazy. I'm over here walking to Staples and I just made another sale. Perfect timing, man, because I'm here. We here, y'all. We made the Staples, right? Oh, nah. They got Shaq in this thing. Oh, I should get this big old bubble wrap. Made it to the boxes. At least they got some more boxes. Last time I came, they had nothing, son. But I need to grab some big ones. I need everything, man. Everything. Run it all. Run it all. Come on. All of this. All of this. Give me all of this. I need it all. I need it all. Makes so much sense, y'all. The small ones are on the other side. So now I can grab some small ones like this one right here. Back home, man. Y'all see, got the box. We got four boxes. Got these big boxes. Got the bubble wrap tape. What the? Damn, my keys. Y'all, like I told y'all outside, I was walking. And I just see 
I got another sale while I'm on the way walking, and it was the Galaxy gun. Let me grab it, man. I forgot all about this, bro. I didn't even know I had this. Where's it at? My oh, who stole my Galaxy? Yeah. Nah. There you go. Thought someone stole my Galaxy gun, man. Y'all see? Got the Galaxy right. Got the Galaxy right here, man. And it's got that switch. This fully. Wow. But yeah, yeah. This one right here. Out of here. Just sold. I think that was 90 bucks. Got that out of here for 90 bucks, man. Now, time to package up my three straps, which is boom, boom, and the long AR, which is on my bed. Y'all stay tuned. We about to go POV style. All right, y'all. Time to package these things up, man. Got the 1911. Got the little Galaxy or whatever you want to call this. I don't even know what this is called, but I know we got that switchy. And then we got the AR over there I can see laid out, man. First thing we're going to package is probably this right here. Yo, this thing is heavy, man. This drum mag is heavy. But, oh, I ain't mean to do that. My fault, Brody, because I ain't mine no more. I forgot. These aren't mine. These are purchased. I'm touching somebody else's grips right now. Hold on. Let me chill. Let me chill. Had to put on some hand sanitizer real quick. You feel me? For God, these are my chops, you feel me? Gotta be nice and gentle, you feel me? Because if it was mine, I would throw that thing. All right, so we got these boxes right here. These boxes are small. I know I'll grab one that's a little bigger. Let me see. Oh, this thing's small. Then I grab a bigger one? Which one's the bigger one? These like the same thing. Oh, did it say the size? No, I don't say the size. Oh, dude. Eight by six by six. 866, eight, no, eight by six, six. They know the same thing. Eight by six, six, they are. All right, so let me just see if it fits. If not, I'm gonna just package the Galaxy stuff first. Boom, 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 boom. Gotta grab my tape real quick. Uh, got the tape, the new tape. Actually, I might use my old tape. Should I use my old tape? Low key, this one, mm, I don't think it matters. Nah, I'm gonna go grab my old tape. Hold on, y'all. All right, y'all, I got my tape. Peel this thing off. Oh, damn, I dropped the tape. Close the bottom real quick. Oh. Bow. Just had that shut. Boom, so let me see. Oh, no. Let me see if this will even fit. This is not fit. What the heck? <gasps> Low key? Oh, oh no, it's gonna break. Oh nah, let me not do that. Nope, that's not happening. But with this, it's clear. It's clear. Boom. Um, wow. This fit. Put it like that. Wow. Okay, so this is perfect. Have it just like that. But of course, gotta hit it with the uh, bubble wrap. Bubble wrap this thing. Make sure it's nice and. Uh, Make sure it's nice and secure. There. Oh. Boom. I'm going to use this for the mag. Mm. Oh. Wow. Got that around. That's kind of a lot. Hold on. Put it more in the middle. Damn, I don't even think I need this much bu bubble wrap to just the mag. But it's cool. Extra protection the better, you feel me? Oh, we stay strapped up, mate. Uh, where my tape go? Oh, I fell on the floor. Well, I threw it on the floor. Let me not say it fell on the floor. There. Put that over there. Boom. Close this up. Bow. Throw that in there. Grab some more bubble wrap. Boom. Now, gotta wrap up the chop, you work. Boom. Uh, bah. Tape that up. Let's tape. Damn. Boom. Put that in there. Make sure nothing's really moving around too much. Get it closed. Yes, sir. It can close. All right. Perfect. Just like that. But I probably got to throw in some more bubble wrap to fill it up. Yeah, I don't want it bouncing everywhere. Hold on. Let me grab some more.
Up like that. We should be good. Yeah, we should be good like that. Wow. With the tape. With the tape. Damn, bro. I keep throwing my tape on the floor. Just like that, hold on. Bow. Package one completed. Well, not completed. You know, I got to stack that label on top. But, bow. Yeah. The other boxes are just way too big, bro. Like, just look at that. Way too big just for this little, feel me, just for this little strap, man. So, I'm going to try to force it inside the little box. Hopefully, it actually goes in. Damn. Let's see. Wow. Boom. All right, let's try this out. All right, which way should I try? This way. Wait, so that will go like that. Oh, that look, that actually fits. And then I can put this like sideways. Like that. Oh, that's fire. Oh, I forgot. I got to bubble wrap it. Is it close? Oh, it do. Perfect. But hopefully the bubble wrap, the bubble wrap is going to make it thicker. So it might not close. Let's see. I ain't gonna use too much bubble wrap then. Ah, alright. We just need boom. Damn, it's kind of a lot, but at the end of the day, bro. Oh, damn. At the end of the day, the package has to be, you know, safe. Alright, probably close it like that. Damn, it's gonna be too thick now. I don't think it's gonna close. Damn. All right. We got that bubble wrap now. <sighs> bubble wrap this big old drum mag. Boom. No. Maybe like that. It don't got to be perfect. Alright, bye. Oh, it's kind of bending the box. Hopefully the box doesn't break. It's looking a little crazy now. Mm. How did I have it? Wait, what? Like that, right? I mean, I can close it still. Oh, nah. Box is going rip. Hold on. Let me figure this out. Why did I just have it? Like that? Oh. Y'all stay tuned. Well, actually. Y'all get to see me struggle. Let me try putting the gun in first. Let's put this. This way. Bow. Now, just go right on top. Boom. Did it close? Nope. Oh, there it go. Bow, bow. Should I put some more bubble wrap to hold this still? Nope. I'm good. I'm good off that. Oh, my God. Look how it's stretching out. I'm going to just put so much tape so it just doesn't, you know, break open. But, yeah, this package completed. I'm going to tape it up. Yeah, stay tuned. Package number two completed. Extra tape this thing. I don't need this thing coming out. Look. Nothing shaking in there. Perfect. On to the third, which I low-key don't think I have a box for. That thing is too long. But I did, like, recently I did unboxing on the shotgun. So I'm probably going to use the old box from the shotgun to put it, well, to use it for this. So y'all stay tuned for that. Look, yeah, this is the box right here. As you can see, though, it's kind of, like, all ripped up, though. But I could probably fix it up. Yeah, I'll probably go fix it up. Hold on. Uh, y'all stay tuned because I don't want to bore y'all too much. Well, never mind. I keep forgetting this is the whole point of the video. You know, me just shipping off my guns. Um, can I open? Hold on. Uh, no, I'm just ripping the box. 
five. Got it open. Damn. A broken box. Let me see. Could it fit? Oh, you're lying. Oh, please tell me the stock goes. Let's go. Still doesn't fit. Damn, it still don't fit. That thing is so wrong. Damn, my teeth hurt from biting the tape. Cause I have to rip it. Uh, yeah, I'm going to figure something out. Y'all just stay tuned, man. I'm stressed out, man. Hey, man, I did it. Yeah, I had to, like, make this. Like, as you can see, like, I added, like, an extra box to make it longer. I can't explain it, man. But that's why... Oh, tape coming off. But that's why I had to stop the camera because I really had to, you know, I had to focus. I had to lock in. I couldn't really lock in with the camera. But, hey, I did it. And that's... Oh, I already did all three packages. We got that. And then we got... The two packages right here. Boom, boom. Yes, sir. Hopefully, I put the right labels. I imagine I put the wrong label, like, on the box. And then someone, like, the person that ordered that AR, he gets a damn pistol. Would he be mad? Yeah, he'd probably be mad because it's cheaper. But anyways, we did it, man. All right, y'all. I'm probably going to end this video right here. These packages, I'm going to ship them off in the morning. I can't ship them today because it's Sunday. I already know. Sundays, no deliveries. Well, not no deliveries. Well, no deliveries and... Post office be closed, but as you can see, we got both of these right here, and then we got the big boy right here. Yes, sir. But anyways, y'all, y'all hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and y'all already know I got a whole bunch of other ones I got to sell. So if y'all want to see more of these, y'all let me know, man. But peace, bro. I'm sitting here like, oh my gosh, which is which? But luckily, you remember, on the 1911, I put extra tape, and it's kind of like outwards because it was bigger. So that's how I knew it was this one. But I was really here for like five minutes trying to be like, should I open it or not? But I already like packaged it so good, so I'm like, I don't want to open it. But I remembered. This one is definitely the, the 19, well, 2011 with the drum mag. I keep saying 1911. But yeah, I just had to let you guys know that. But now, I'm out for real. Bye.